All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Sifu, and today we are joined with someone who has not been in the series since Sonic. No, CFTs. No, you were not Sonic. Sonic. Yeah, Sonic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I was like, I don't think, I don't think he did any videos with Sea of Thieves. No, this he is, did. Yeah, did. did you really? Yeah. Oh. It was with uh, it was with uh, James and Joe. Yeah, and that shit talk someone in it. Oh wait, is that on your channel? Yeah. Yeah. What the hell? Why have I never seen that? I'm not a true friend, bro. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm not. We did the sea shanty. Or not sea shanty. We did I forgot what it's fucking called. Yeah, no, yeah. I So James I didn't here. know that that was there. So James is the one that convinced me to get this game and, you know, record. How are you gonna let a guy reading a book beat your ass, bro? I wasn't thinking. I was, I was. I was focusing on talking. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm also back. So sorry about that. I went on vacation and uh, I came back recently. So hello again, the uh, the viewers that are watching. All right. I feel like playing Elden Ring has definitely helped me with this game. I mean, uh, probably. I, I kind of, I mean, I got hit a couple times with that first guy, but like, that second round, I, I don't think I got hit. Have you played Absolver before? Zaru? No, Ab Absolver. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's made by the same people, I think, who made the, that game. Like this oh. game. The similar combat. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen some of the fights that are in Absolver, like, between, like, players, and it actually looks... Really insane. I think it's still on Game Pass. Super. That might be console Game Pass. Oh okay. Dude, that For was a fun game. Is coming out. Oh god, Which that's game? gonna get toxic. For on a crossplay. Oh, crossplay. Wow. Yeah. On cross progression though. Yeah, that'll be cool. I miss my my good stuff. I know. I wish I had all my stuff. They released a pirate bitch. She's kind of crap. Oh. Tell yeah, it's been a that. while since I've even touched that game. I probably played like a month ago. Yeah, I used to play a lot of Lawbringer. And then as soon as I heard or seen, uh, what is it? Uh, Highlander. Yeah, that was that was it. Remember I freaking love Highlander. With my monkey. Yeah. And then JJ. JJ. I can't oh, remember. Shit. JJ is the fat old guy. The one who does oh. like the spinny with the spears. Spinny with the spears. Uh, Honestly, no. I, I cannot remember. I can send you a picture. Yeah. But, yeah, so how's Elden Ring for both of you? I mean, I know both of you play it almost religiously now. I think it's to the point where, like, um, I'm getting tired of, like, constantly preparing. And, like, I'm the kind of person that, like, I like hack and slashes more. So, like, I'm thinking about... And I got decently far. and But I also, like, exploit the game, too, so... You already did? No, I didn't mod it, but I exploited it. Yeah, he's 200, which requires 2 million uh, XP, essentially. Or no, 20 million XP. Oh, like yeah, what? Like, you just found like a farming spot or something? I'm or? AFK. Oh, okay. So, uh, when, when I went to work, I think it was like last Thursday. Um, It was like Wednesday oh, going into Thursday. No, I died before. Oh. Um, it was last... It was like Thursday going into Friday. That's changing, uh, by the way. Oh, okay. Um, I found this AFK spot where I just set up a macro on my Steam Deck. To, uh. like... Because all, all you have to do, like, the things automatically come near you. And it falls off a cliff. So I just kind of sat there... And um, 
like every like I set it so like every like five minutes it sits at a bonfire, and it gives you like thirteen thousand uh, runes for it. And, oh, um, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, but no, no, I, it's I not did... the place in the hellscape place. Cause well, I know that no, one. I mean, I. I'm just saying, it's the place on a cliff, right? And you shoot the bird with an arrow, or no? No, you don't oh. shoot anything. It, like, wanders towards you, and then it falls off a cliff, and, like, if you keep it in a certain spot. So, oh. like, I, like, sat there for a little bit, just, like, making sure it's not going to run around, but no, every time it falls off the cliff. Oh, that's and crazy. you get the rune, so I set it so it presses, uh, I think it was E to set a bonfire. Oh. Uh, I said that the hit hit every five minutes, and then I let it go all night and all day at work, and My then I God. got back on and I had a fuck ton of runes, and I like specked my guy out, and right now I'm working towards um getting my or respecting my guy. Jesus. Well, I mean, yeah, and, I mean it's not considered mining, but. I mean, no, it's still at cheating, least if you're having but, fun, then, then but I'm not like I'm matters. going through the rough of it still. So like I'm like not doing like you know instant death or anything like that. But at the same oh. time, like I'm also kind of getting impatient. Like continuing through the game, or yeah. Oh, so I was thinking about just like saying screw it, I'll accept the ban, and just turning Wii mod on, and then. Using it to like just get my stats out. I didn't have to kill that guy. I just love killing. The thing guy. is, if you're level two hundred, you should be one shotting everything. Cause at one hundred with the the Radon swords, I was essentially one shotting all the bots or I like ads, and then bosses is the only one that I would have to uh, do more. See, and that's why I want to respect because I I'm not, <laughs> you know. You know, because I'm on my third playthrough. I'm already half, or I'm essentially near the end. Like, I just need to fight three bosses, then I'm done again. And I'm 173. Wait, you're already that far in your third playthrough? Yeah. You can beat the game in 45 minutes. Oh, yeah. I guess if you have, like, all the, um. No, even, like, just at the start, like, what makes a game feel long is you're exploring to get different weapons, but it's really short. Like, Pretty much after we're done, you just have to fight probably like four bosses depending on your ending, and you're done. Yeah, yeah. that's wild. I know I seen something on that. And when um, you get when you get new game plus, do you keep your map and stuff. You don't keep your teleport, but you keep like the maps like visible and like all the th everything's on there that you've unlocked. Yeah, no shit. Oh, hey, real quick, what kind of uh, skill should I get? Oh, uh, what is a ground counter? I'm gonna go with a counter. Ground counter? That was pretty dope. But yeah. Yeah, be yeah, but how many times are you gonna be on the ground? You know, a lot. All the time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, no. Like, is it just them knocking you down? Like, is that how you just straight no, up end I on like the ground? You just have to crouch. I don't think you can crouch. Frank, did I show you my second playthrough uh, screenshot that I took? Mm, I don't know. I mean, you showed me just your character, but... Yeah, that was from the first ending. This the oh. one I sent you now is from the second ending. That's your character? Yeah. He has like a flaming head? Yeah, that's for the ending that I got. What the heck? Yeah, so there's three types of ending. There's Age of... Stars, I think it's called. Something uh, frenzy, flame frenzy, or some shit. And then Elden Lord is like the three ending types. Yeah. But there's six in total, and then there's a seventh one that is confirmed, but no one found. Uh, like the requirements. Oh. And I've gotten the requirement. Like my first playthrough, I did the requirement to pretty much get all the endings. And then um, that way, I just know I did like those quest lines. Yeah. And then on my current playthrough, um, I just gotta do a very simple ending and I'm done.
Like, I have all the achievements on Steam. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, that's... That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, I... I have... I'll have all the achievements on Steam on that. And also Resident Evil, if I beat it on the hardest difficulty. Same thing, I'll have all the achievements. Yeah, this didn't is the you beat that I've game gotten. in like under three hours or something? Yeah, so there's an achievement for beating it under three hours. Uh, I did that run. I did no or no guns, so all I had to use was a knife. I oh, did wow. don't buy anything and don't heal more than three times, and I think only healed once, all in one uh, playthrough to get all those things done in like one go. Oh, that's nuts. Tyler, you didn't play Village, right? No. It's lacking, boy. So I would, I'm just not like that hard into Resident Evil games. Yeah, that's like the same with me. I like as cool as it looks and like, you know, like I'll watch the gameplay and stuff, but um, yeah, playing the games, it just I never got into it. I didn't like the classic ones. Try to get your ass. What, bro? I did. I did. Yeah. I didn't care for the classic one because I hated the camera view. But whenever they released seven on Game Pass Biohazard, mm -hmm. I played it and then I fucking loved it. Nope, so then I did is... everything in that, too. This is my last life. Oh, and then you have to restart from the very beginning or? Yep. Oh, wow. Tyler, do you well, like you better hope you beat games? it. What's up? Do you like rogue-like games? Rogue? Like sneaking the, around? The John no, no, the genre roguelite. I don't know what that is. Uh, it's like Risk to Rain, um, Gunfire Reborn, uh, Wizards of Legends, stuff like that. You are not supposed to be part of tonight's group. Take your silence as a no. Frank, yeah, I'm, I, I'm sorry. I don't I'm, think he knows. No, I don't. I'm also concentrating on this right now. <laughs> I also have no idea. Essentially, it's, uh, you have to beat the game in one life. But like every time you die, you get some of them. Some of them you don't. You get uh, what's it call it? Um, you get different awards to help you. Oh. Shit. Yeah, no, that's pretty decent though. Yeah. So like, Wizard of Legends, the last one. No, Wizard of Legends. Game over. That was a game over. Damn. Yeah, so. I would... and see how it starts us up back at uh, H40, Frank? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, like, that's, um. That's the level that we finished the this level off of, the first one. Or not the late yeah. like, age. So, I we would go get back to that. If it was on Steam. Yeah. Oh, this game isn't on Steam? No, it's on no. Epic. Yeah. Oh, um, okay. Not sponsored. Yeah, right. Which is weird that they only released on Epic. Yeah, I know. This seems like it would be a Steam game, but... I don't know. Yeah, I think the only games I have on Epic are, like, free games. No, I have, like, Tony Hawk... Uh, Watch Dogs 2. Oh, yeah, that's true. Well, yeah, I think Watch Dogs 2, I, I think I got for free. I think I got it for free, too. And then, um, I think I also had GTA on there, but I stopped playing that on there because I got it on Steam. I have Rogue Company and Fortnite. Those are the only things I've downloaded on Epic. Then I have a bunch of, like, the free games that they release. Yeah. Which I want to play Windbound. They released that for free like last month and that looked pretty decent. What is, is it that, called? Isn't that a survival craft? Yeah, it's survival. Uh, like, it's a guy who got stranded on the island and then there's like bosses, but I think you have to beat it in one life. Like, if you die, you have to restart from the like very, yeah, very, very to, beginning? 
Yeah, but you obviously retain the knowledge of like puzzles, so you can easily like speed through it. Oh, it's like uh, what's it called? What was that game that Jonathan was playing? The space game. Uh um, Outer Wilds. Yeah, that's a very good game, and I would totally play it on this, but. I mean, like, I know how it all goes now, so it wouldn't be, like, as engaging. Which sucks, because, like, that's the only thing, like, I hate about, like, doing, like, YouTube. Is because, like, I like having that fresh experience with the game. To a certain extent, because, like, I will go on the game to figure out how to play it. Before, so, like, you know, the content's actually watchable. But, like, I don't, like, go too far into the story. Um. And, no. Uh so typically I gotta stick with like new games that I haven't played before but that's for like Sonic Sonic was like the only one that I've like played a sh like a lot oh yeah both. that was right. a lot of revisiting childhood memories yeah I want the Which, new Sonic already and um James you're still doing that series with me right yeah I'll probably be playing it uh before you record but oh yeah it's is very looks very good when is that supposed to come out? Mm, I thought it was summer this year, but I could be wrong. Let me look it up. Oh, skip. It just says 2022. No yeah. real. Or it says holiday, so Christmas. I know something that got released on this past Friday, um, or yesterday. Is the new scrap mechanic devlog and i'm super excited for it this sucks because they said the next update is gonna be the challenge mode update like uh as far as major and that's coming in may so it's gonna still be a while that is a yikes yeah i want kirby kirby comes out soon i think that oh, does yeah, look cool I gotta i'm waiting for freaking wii sports and super strikers to yeah, come out on the Baker, switch for oh. sure i'm gonna get i'll try to get kirby day one if not i'll just wait whenever i have the money and i'll get it when does striker come out is there a day for that uh there is i think it's sometime around may and then i think i want to say we sports is april no striker's june oh Okay. What's the so actual then, Nintendo? Uh, okay, it's called Nintendo Switch Sports. April. Okay, so yeah, so the April and June. Yeah. You know, also awesome comes soon. E3 what? boys, which is gonna oh, yeah, be dog. What is it called? E3. E3. Oh, the, yeah, dur. Yeah. So I, I don't know why I'm like forgetting about that. I'm like, holy shit. I just, I don't know. I felt like a lot of triple A games let me down recently. So I prefer more yeah. games. You know, I, I, I um... feel like. What's up? No, you started your stuff. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, sorry. I yeah, know I heard you talking, so I stopped. <laughs> Um, yeah, no, I don't think we're going to get through this level today, guys. Yeah, that's, that's rough. I mean, honestly, it, you know, it just, it's kind of like, uh, you know, you, you live and you learn. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, Frank. Yeah, please. Yeah. So do you want to talk about your recent trip? Oh, yeah, Texas. Yeah, so Texas was really good. Um, yeah, my mom had moved out there uh, sometime last year. And it was uh, my first time seeing her out there with my sister. It was really, really fun. Got to see a lot of restaurants and eat there or eat at the restaurants. Um, and then uh, we went to a few malls. And it was it was a really good time. Um now the cool thing though is that at the mall, I ended up running into a guy that had a snake 
<laughs> and I didn't realize that he actually had a snake until I got like close to him and I'm like, oh my gosh, like that's that's real, you know. So I asked him, I was like, Yeah, is that is that real? And he's like, Hell yeah, dude. And then he immediately like took it off of him because he had it around his neck. And uh he took it off of him and then just like gave it to me essentially and I'm like, What? So I uh yeah, I um I'm getting a snake. <laughs> Needless to say. <laughs> I don't hate so, to have a snake. Too much maintenance, bruh. Nah, dude, very little. Yeah, and then Frank told me today, he's like, yeah, no, no, later on the line, I'll get a cat. I was like, dude, yeah. the cat's going to die. They don't eat cats. No, yeah. finding them cats will fuck it up, though. Yeah, but I mean, if I was stupid about it, like, I wouldn't, like, you know, I wouldn't leave a snake out in the open with the cat, just, you know, right near it. Just in case, you never know. Oh, but from trip to goner. Yeah. Right. But yeah, no, I I wouldn't I wouldn't be that stupid. Uh, but yeah, overall, trip was uh very nice, and um, yeah, can't wait to go back. <laughs> Feels good to be back. And it's funny Here. because like I'm like I'm just super against the snake. I hate snakes. Yeah, Tyler's not a reptile kind of guy. And it's funny because like everyone that he's told to, I think James is like the only one that's like responded well to it. And Stephanie, James, but, Joe, and Stephanie. Um, I I just don't have opinions. I just don't have opinions. But um, yeah, everyone else is like yeah, or anyone who has a key to Frank's apartment is like yeah, no. We're giving that back. Yeah. But I'm like, I don't care. Um, I'm doing what I want to do. It's my apartment. If you don't want to come over, sorry, right, you know. Uh. All right, we're back. I don't know. This. I think the thought of having a snake is cool, but then when you have one, you just kind of like, it's just there, you know. Oh yeah. It's not like a dog where you're like. Do shit with it. Yeah, that's true. I'll just I'll just put my snake on a leash, and then just take it for a walk. <laughs> just walk I'll take it. it for a slither. <laughs> and I told him too. I was like, you know, like like I don't like reptiles at all, but I can get more behind it, like an iguana and a lizard than a snake. Oh yeah, an iguana I, would be. So I don't see cool. a lizard or a snake as a pet because I just walk outside and I see them, bro. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. See, but like, I mean, I would want a straight up, uh, what is that? A chameleon? Like the, the thing that, you know, would touch things and turn different yeah. colors. Yeah, that's chameleon. Now that I would get. Are you getting a big really snake cool. or are you getting a tiny snake? Well, it starts out small, but over time, like, like after three years is when it's like a full grown snake. Or ball python is what it's called. Um, they start off small, like they could fit just like right in your hand, like really small. But after oh, three gosh. years, they get up to like almost six feet, and they're like they're girthy. Oh yeah, I All see right. that. So yeah, no, I think in three years you're gonna regret that bitch. Nah. All right, but nah, on that I note. Love it. We are going to continue this some other time um, with either Rest a new game peace. or I don't know yet. I got to make some decisions <laughs> because I think uh, you should try to lower your age before the next level. I, I don't even know how to lower the age. I'm assuming you would just have to replay the first game. The first oh, level. OK. I see. Yeah. Yeah. I might do that then because of um. how much is this game? I might buy it. <laughs> I think it's like 40 bucks but uh, on that note we will talk to you guys later uh, make sure to like subscribe comment your favorite part down below and um, yeah thank you guys for also like I mean on TikTok I'm at like 1300 followers now <laughs> and that's fucking awesome and I couldn't think yeah, that's nuts. you know the TikTok followers enough and um, 
if you want to make TikTok jealous, subscribe to my YouTube account. Um, but yeah, on that note, we will talk to you later. Peace out. Thanks, James, for joining. Bye. All right. Bye.